Anshuman Gaikwad's scoring range was limited and his batting lacked elegance, but raw courage against pace that he possessed was a precious commodity in Indian cricket, and it wouldn't be an exaggeration to say that he made it into the team on that virtue alone. He also had terrific reserves of patience and concentration. He batted 671 minutes for his test best 0-1 against Pakistan at Jalandhar in 1982-83. This was then the slowest double century in first-class cricket. Gaikwad's Guts and Glory saga reached its peak when, bruised and battered by Michael Holding's modern-day borderline in the 1975-76 Jamaica bloodbath, he scored 81, a feat rendered doubly impressive by the fact that it came in an era when there were neither helmets nor restrictions on bouncers. Gaikwad had to have an operation after he was tatted on the ear by a holding bouncer that punctured his eardrum. He signed off on a high, with a hundred in his last first-class match and later became a selector and the national coach. Anshuman Gaikwad debuted in Test cricket against West Indies at Eden Gardens on 27 December 1974. His last test match was against England also at Eden Gardens on 31st December 1984. Anshuman Gaikwad debuted in ODI cricket against England at Lords on 7 June 1975. His last ODI match was against West Indies at Guwahati on 23rd December 1987. Anshuman Gaikwad played 40 test matches, 70 innings, and scored 1,985 runs with a batting average of 30.07. His highest score of 201 against Pakistan at Jalandhar in 1983 didn't help much as the test ended in a draw. He hits two centuries and ten half centuries in his entire test career. As a fielder he took 15 catches. Anshuman Gaikwad played 15 ODI matches, 14 innings, and scored 269 runs in his entire ODI career with a low batting average of 20.69. His ODI strike rate is 52.84. His highest ODI score of 78 not out against Pakistan at Sahiwal in 1978 was one of the controversial match in one-day cricket history. Captain late Bishan Singh Bedi conceded the match in protest against the short-pitched bowling tactics of Pakistan. Sarfaraz Nawaz's last four deliveries were all out of reach of the batsman and not called wide by the umpire. At that time India was cruising to the victory with only 13 needed of 14 balls with 8 wickets in hand. Anshuman Gaikwad hits one half century in his entire ODI career. As a fielder, he took six catches. Anshuman Gaikwad had a fantastic first-class record. He played 206 matches. 326 innings and scored 12,136 runs with a beautiful batting average of 41.56. His highest score in first-class cricket is 225. He has 34 centuries in his kitty. He also took 143 wickets with 649's best bowling in first-class cricket. In list A cricket, Anshuman Gaikwad played 55 matches. 53 innings, and scored 1,601 runs with a batting average of 32.67.